Boy, do I have some updates for you. You're going to want to watch this one to see what I am up to these days and what I have planned in the next coming few months. Hi, I'm Jamie Reynolds. And if you don't know me, I am a newbie on the scene of making a YouTube video. I'm on TikTok. I'm on a few other social media platforms. But basically, I'm a nine to fiver and I'm working towards retiring from my nine to five and supplementing my retirement income by by creating content and, and 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 other things online so near the end of 2022 i was pretty darn skeptical about making money online and then something clicked in me and i just decided to go for it and i spent all of 2023 working on that and i think i've got a good momentum and now that we're in 2024 it's time to start planning. It's time to start putting some concrete things into place. Okay, maybe not concrete. I'm not a fan of concrete. But start putting some plans into place in, in directions that, that I'm going in and, and do this the right way. And by the right way, I mean read the terms and conditions, you know, hire a tax attorney, um, like, like <laughs> do all of the businessy things that I need to do and come up with a strategy for how I'm, I'm going to do all of this. I think I've decided to ditch some of my social media platforms in order to focus on the one that I actually enjoy doing. So I enjoy TikTok and I enjoy YouTube. So Facebook and Instagram are probably gonna get the boot and Pinterest are probably gonna get, a, get the boot at least for now. Maybe someday when I hire a social media manager, I can add them back. But I just decided I don't enjoy doing them. So why make myself do them? Other updates, I've been participating in the TikTok shop program more. So I've been buy I've actually been buying all of the products that I've been making videos about, uh, affiliate videos about on the TikTok shop. And I learned as a business account on TikTok, you can't get free samples. And I was like, how is everyone getting all these samples? So I learned that, switched my account from a business account to a creator account or slash personal account. And then now I'm able to request samples of free products. So I actually have... I think three different samples on the way. Some of them are pretty pricey. I mean, I think one of them was $80, one of them, two, actually both of them were $80 and then another one was like $20. I was actually surprised that a shop owner would send me something of such a high value to do a video on, but you know, maybe my stats look good and maybe that's why they approved. So those are coming and I'm gonna be making videos on those. So I haven't been making sales consistently on the site. So I'm gonna continue working on how to structure my videos so that I can convert better. I'm also gonna work on my participating in the uh, TikTok creativity program beta. I can get paid for views on videos as long as I do a video that's over a minute and gets over a thousand views. I, I've only made about $80 on that in about two and a half, three months. So not doing very well. So I've gotta kind of like figure that out and unlock that so that I can capitalize on on making money in that way so my whole entire goal will kind of be maybe three pronged where i have you know tips and tricks and things about me you know behind the scenes as one slice of the pie uh tiktok shop as another slice of the pie but the tiktok shop products are going to relate to my niche and you know what i'm talking about in my non you know um product-based videos and then i'm going to have another slice of the pie that are where i'm going to be focusing more on those one minute or longer videos so really kind of like two-thirds of the of the pie is going to be around the you know talking videos and education and and that kind of thing but only probably one third is where i'll be focusing on those one minute or longer so hopefully that makes sense so one third tiktok shop videos uh one third videos that are related to my niche that are under one minute and then one third videos that are related to my niche over one third hoping to capitalize on the creativity program but at least that's the strategy that i'm going for i can't have all of my videos be over one minute uh i can't make money off of videos that are over one minute that are a TikTok shop so it's like <laughs> there's like this balance that i've got to achieve so i'm going to be uh working on that i think i figured out my niche on TikTok. I love the idea of promoting, not really promoting, I love the idea of talking about wellness and what wellness means to me. It's, it's again, another three-pronged thing for me. It's physical wellness, uh, mental wellness, and then the idea of living well, meaning 
having the things that I need in order to live well and be well, um, like solutions to problems that I have or, um, you know, like, I don't, I don't know. I'll, I'll work on that more, but that's what I think my, my TikTok is going to be about. I also will have a link on my TikTok account. I don't know where that link is going to go yet. That's something that I still need to work on. I think I'm going to stop the idea of maybe having a separate like stand store or something like that. I have been thinking more of going into more of a newsletter style, not so much like email marketing, although because I feel like there's two different kinds of email marketing. There's one where you're just selling products, but, but you're giving some value. I kind of would rather have it be more the other way where I'm giving so much value and information and, and news and curating stuff. And then every once in a while, inserting something there like an affiliate link or, you know, somewhere that kind of points somebody to something that would make me some money. Um, I would also like to earn money on my newsletter someday. And that's why I was thinking about going back and using Beehive. Beehive is a good newsletter platform for growing your newsletter and then also making money off of your newsletter. I can try to get sponsors and stuff like that if I can grow my list big enough. So that is another avenue that I'm working on. And then in addition, I'm still going to be doing the Amazon Influencer uh, Onsite Commissions program. I'm going to start recording my videos in the landscape 16 by nine uh, ratio for uh, Amazon because I've been hearing that those videos do better commission-wise, they convert better. So I'm going to be looking at all the things that I've already made, uh, portrait 9x16 videos, remake them, make them in a better style, because I've learned a lot in the past, you know, four or five months about making videos. So I think I can make them better so that they can convert more. And then I will just continue making the new ones in the 16x9 as things come in the door. I've got stuff that... I bought and I'm also getting gifted on the TikTok shop that, that they also sell on Amazon. So I think I can do that with those products. I'm going to do that. I know that I said in the beginning of this video that I talked about uh, shutting down my Instagram and my Facebook account. Another thought is possibly in the future making Facebook, maybe not Facebook, making my Instagram account my Amazon uh, influencer account and, and kind of splitting my, my stuff that way. So have TikTok, TikTok shop, and then have Instagram be my Amazon influencer where I can put affiliate links in like the, um, stories on my site. I, I don't know. We will see about that. Um, but yeah, I have some stuff that I need to do. Like I want to update my banner on my YouTube channel and update some of my graphics. So I'm going to be doing a video on that and um posting that of course so like i said i'm going to start with that one video of redoing my banner and uploading that and then i'm going to do another video on how i'm going to kind of spruce up my background here i do have a light that i purchased a long time ago that you know put some nice light but i thought maybe maybe i'll get some plants or something but i'm gonna do a video about it i'm gonna do a video about that and then i'll do more videos about the TikTok shop and the creativity program like how i'm progressing on that and then maybe some videos on my newsletter and what platform I ultimately choose. I was looking at Ghost. I think I'm probably gonna go with, with Beehive, but maybe I'll do some videos on setting up my my Beehive newsletter and kind of the stuff that's in there. And um, that's it, I guess. I could just ramble on for hours if you'll let me, but um, I think that's a good enough update to let you know what's going on with me. And uh, if you made it this far, thank you so much. If, if you haven't already subscribed, please consider subscribing. The button is down below and I will see you next time. All right, have a great day, bye.